This is the car I'm building to get me into SCCA. It's an S197 Mustang GT, maximum motorsport suspension, cold air kit on the engine, uh, upgraded drivetrain. It's a Mustang GT uh, Roush Sport, which means basically all you get is a body kit that is actually aerodynamically functional. She's number 641 in the 2006 production year. Uh, and as from Roush Sport, you, what you get is an interior and the body kit, and that's it. Well, again, I can't get a spark plug socket on I got three of them out of there, but the break, I look down in there and I can see something. Do you see down in that hole right there, number three hole? Or? Let's see if you see something around that spark plug. Yeah, it looks like part of the boot. You have a set of pliers or something? The boot. Strong oh, I fingers, I guess. You get the Popeye forearms when you rock climb. Yeah, I'll bet. <laughs> Take this off, straighten it out, and use it as a hook. And I think that might be enough. You don't want to straighten the whole thing out, do you? you no, want you want to leave a little curve at the end. I was thinking you'd want to leave a whole circle, wouldn't you? No, I'm going to try to hook it with this. And... Oh, I... Sorry I tore it up. No, oh, don't worry about that. I just appreciate it so much. DC to DC converter and the battery charger is underneath. Um, so we just plug this into a wall outlet overnight and it charges. 15 amps will allow it to be plugged in anywhere pretty much. Uh, it'll also do uh, 220 and it'll pull more current, current through that. Uh, so if you need a quick charge, you can hook it up to 220. So you have to take that into account too. But it might be on target for 100 mile max range at 100% discharge, which you don't want to do normally. But just to know that if you had to go that far, it will make it. So this has gone from a one-off custom version to a prototype to what is now a proof of concept. I can't wait. Every single car show and motorcycle and environmental event and uh, everything. Yeah. Five and six. Five and six. Mike, did you find it? 
5 and 6. Look at paragraph 5. Bridget? Homes have stopped being homes. Now they are real estate. Now they are real estate. That's right. Homes have stopped being homes. She's sort of lamenting. She is sorry that we've kind of lost that focus on our homes. Mm -hmm.